Keith Peoples is back on the high school sideline. The longtime Schlarman girls coach stepped away back in 2019 to coach his son at the junior high level. He's still with the junior high team, but now he's also taking over the varsity boys coaching role as well. WCIA 3's Bryce Beeman has more on Peoples' full circle run with the toppers. Keith Peoples is no stranger to winning. With two high school state championships under his belt, plus five at the junior high level, the Slarman boys basketball head coach is taking on his next challenge. We want to win a state championship, but we understand it's a process, and it's not going to happen overnight. Our main focus right now is building habits, character habits. We haven't had a lot of success at the varsity level here at Slarman, um, and we're here to change that. And he has a lot of work to do. The Hilltoppers are 5 and 14 overall with seven straight losses. The team is young with nine underclassmen and no seniors. But Peoples is using that to his advantage. With this young group, they're starting to believe a coaching staff, they're believing in themselves, and they're believing in each other. That's all I'm asking for right now. But we're going to prepare. We're going to play like we're state contenders no matter what. Peoples took the job to coach his freshman son, Keeson, who is sidelined with a season ending injury. He follows his older sister, Anea, one of the area's highest rated recruits all time. The McDonald's All American was a five star recruit ranked top 25 nationally, leading the toppers to back to back state titles. To help get the program back to that level, Keith brought one of his former assistants with him in OJ Harrison. It's great. We really developed a, a, a brotherhood, a family relationship, a coaching relationship. So it's been good. Like I said, it's been seven years now. Um, we know each other well, and there's just a chemistry we have. So to be alongside him again, it's, it's, it's pretty rewarding. And Keith is confident he can get the boys' program back on the map. After winning 80% of his games in eight years as the girls' head coach, People says he's poised for another run with the boys' program that hasn't won 25 games in a season in 55 years. Take your wins now because Schlorman, it's up. They're coming. Reporting in Danville, I'm Bryce Beeman, WCIA 3 Sports.